Senator, tell me what launching this PAC will enable you to do. Okay, uh, the organization is called securitythroughstrength.com. It will allow me to raise money, to travel, to hire a skeletal staff and do some polling to see if there's a pathway forward, forward for me in the 2016 primary. Mm -hmm. The reason I pick security through strength is a concept that I think embraces who I am and what I'm trying to achieve. Ronald Reagan said peace through strength. I don't believe it's possible to peacefully coexist with radical Islam, but I do believe it's possible to have security through strength by partnering with people over there so we can keep radical Islam off our shores. And security is more than a strong military. It's a strong economy where everybody benefits, not a few. It's an energy independent nation. The name indicates that you think that foreign policy is going to be a big issue in this campaign. I think security is a big issue. If you're a mom at home trying to raise a couple of kids, if you're a dad, single dad with a couple of kids, if you're a single person trying to get out of your parents' basement and uh, chart a life for your own, Security matters, economic security, national security, uh, the security that comes from living in a free and sound uh, a nation called America. So I think it, it's a broad concept that people are looking for. They want to feel secure, free, and at the end of the day, I think we're losing ground on our security at home and abroad. What is going to determine whether you do end up jumping into the race, and when will you decide? If I can be competitive. I'm not going to put my family, my friends, and myself through the hell that comes from running for president. I've been John McCain's sidekick twice on this journey to be president of the United States. Is there a pathway forward uh, outside of South Carolina? Is there a group of people in Iowa that think uh, my national security credentials, my problem-solving nature as a conservative is a good fit for the party? Can I put together something in New Hampshire? Can I be competitive early on? Because I know I'll do well in South Carolina. But can I, can I be competitive in Iowa and New Hampshire? Can I raise the money that would make me competitive? I've never run for an office uh, that I didn't expect to win. I've always taken chances. And to win, you've got to be willing to lose. But I'm not going to make a decision based on emotion. It's going to be a business decision. If there's a pathway forward, I'm not going to let fear stop me from running. But I'm not going to let, uh, you know, desire uh, lead to a bad decision. Why would you want to get into a field that is already looking very crowded? Only in America can you grow up in the back of a liquor store. Neither one of my parents finished high school. My mom and dad owned a uh, restaurant, a liquor store, and a pool room. I can't believe I'm in the United States Senate. Only in America can you have the aspirations of being president of the United States coming from a background like mine and others. But really what drives my thinking is that we've been at war for 13 years. Those men and women who've been on the front lines deserve a commander in chief that knows how to have their back because they've had ours. And that I know I can do.